Hello everyone and welcome to my video with some tips and tricks for you to transition from your running shoes to riding with your bike shoes with your cleats on. So I already um, took off my regular bike pedals. Okay, so let's just pretend na I still am using the regular pedals that's not used for cleats. So I'm putting on my running shoes just to show you how to do it. Um, a little bit of practice even with your running shoes on. So from this exercise, we need to already determine kung alin yung iyong lead leg, the foot that's on top of the pedal, and your landing leg. Okay, so for this instance, my landing leg is my left leg. So assuming that your bike seat is already in the right height, which is kinda mataas naman talaga. So what I'm doing right now is just keeping the lead leg on top of my pedal and landing on my left leg. So just gliding with the bike, landing on my left leg, and also trying to sit on top of my seat. But the main focus of this goal is to make you learn to always, always land on that left leg. So when you've done that already and you are ready to transition to your bike shoes and your pedals with your cleats, try to practice indoors. Same thing clipping in and clipping out. So the main focus of this exercise is for you to try to learn and feel how it is to clip in and out. Of course, always landing on that same leg that you practiced a while ago and leading with that right leg on top of the pedal. So do this a couple of times and maybe sometimes you can try to do it not looking at the pedals as you clip on. Practice going up and down the bike. Always remembering to land on that same leg that you practice. Do this over and over until it becomes second nature to you. So now I think you are ready for the outdoors. Take your bike outdoors with your bike shoes and cleats and try to find a stable wall or maybe um, ginawa namin dati was beside a car just be careful not to scratch the car but for this instance it's a pole so this time try to feel how you're gonna balance on the bike even as you twist your heels out as you release your pedals or your cleats from your pedals do this a couple of times and then do this also on the other side and try to feel the release of your bike shoes. Also challenge yourself by balancing clipping in and clipping out of your pedals even as you are away from your wall or the car. Do this a couple of times, maybe 20 to 30 reps. Sometimes try to close your eyes as well as you do it. And I think you are ready to move on to the next round. Try to find a space where it is safe to glide around with your bike Maybe somewhere where there's less traffic.
And just like our first challenge, we glide, but this time we are gliding with our cleats clipped on the pedal. So try to remember what you practice. Uh, for our practice here, the lead leg is the right leg, so it stays on top of the pedal. And you land on the left leg. So always remember to land on that one leg that you are comfortable landing on. So why do we always land on the left leg? Okay, so just for my personal preference, guys, let me show you. Um, when you are landing on the left leg, it's a little bit safer because sometimes on the right side, it is a gutter or uh, worse, means an bangin po siya ang nandyan sa kanan nyo. So if you actually fall down, you lose your balance, it is a little safer to land on that left leg. Now, if you can try to find a space that has a little bit of an incline, okay, I find this a little bit more easy for this mounting exercise. So what you want to do is to first put your pedal on that 3 o'clock position. As you push on the pedal, this will help you to move your bike forward easily. Do this a couple of times and with your practice of the gliding exercises, try to actually sit on your bike or mount on your bike seat with balance. Try to feel how your hands are positioning on the handlebars, bracing your abs, bracing your core. But Always, always remember, don't be afraid to land and catch yourself on that leg that you've always practiced. And so now, once you've already attained that ability to sit on your bike seat, uh, you don't have to pedal immediately. Just uh, take your time and study it. Um, if you want to try to pedal already, go right ahead. But... It's okay to keep on um, remembering your exercise to land on that left leg. So once you've managed to actually keep the bike moving, um, you can pedal on that leg even if you're not clipped into the pedal yet. Just to keep the bike uh, moving and when you are ready to clip into your cleats, uh, find your balance, uh, take your time, then go right ahead and clip that other leg and begin to roll into your pedals. It's okay, take your time, and maybe um, when you manage already, na nakaupo na kayo sa seat, um, go right ahead and yung uh, landing leg nyo, take it off and start paddling even if you're not clipped in to the cleats yet. So just push on the pedal even if you're not clipped in yet and once you are already moving, go right ahead, brace your belly, find your balance and finally clip in to your pedals. So there you have it everyone. I hope you learned a lot from this video and if you have any questions just please feel free to hit it up right down on the comment section below and hopefully I will see you out there with your bike shoes and your cleats. Nang kami talaga guys, my bike without mask with lots of friends. Uh, but for now, I need you guys to stay safe, keep protected. If you need to go bike out with a group, keep that group small. Better yet, go solo riding. Better yet, just uh, go train indoors. Keep your strength, keep training, don't stop. So that's about it guys. Thank you very much. Take care.